In this movie, I'm going to show how to import process point files into Chimera. Process point files are files that are in an XYZ format and have already had sound velocity and tide applied to them. So I need to create a new project and with some of these process point files the coordinate system uh, that they're in Chimera won't be automatically able to detect them uh, so sometimes you have to specify the coordinate system for the project when you create the project like I've just done here. I then go to add process point files and I select my files in this case this is the FAU files which are a, uh, a Danish uh, format but uh, essentially it's XYZ information underneath. It assumes that it's the same coordinate system of the project unless you tell it otherwise here. And then what it's doing now is converting internally the format from an FAU to our own internal QPD format which is what we use for our point files underneath everything in Chimera. We now have our process point files here which I want to create into a dynamic surface. I'll do that doing here, selecting a name and a cell size. I won't cube and then finish. This then creates our dynamic surface to allow us to process the data and also to uh, validate the data depending on what your process is here. So that's our 2D view, our 3D view. If I turn off the files, can zoom in here and when I come over to my dynamic surface here I can color by uh, and show I can show shallow data the average surface I can also color by a standard deviation and slightly differently in Chimera now when you select the down arrow you can adjust the color map range here so we can move the color map down here and apply that See, I'm just changing the colour map settings here, and massaging the colours to affect to show any differences. If I then come in, I can come over and select my area. If I want, I can move to the middle there and drag the box around, and then launch the 3D editor. This is now, in this case, coloured by depth. I can colour by file as well. I can then highlight the soundings that I want, press reject, and then if I do file, save and exit, my DTM updates. And this is how you process data in Chimera.